So in studio this morning, my guest is the lovely Stacey Benjamin, who is an image consultant and so much more. So much more. So Good much morning, Stacy. Good morning, Lisa. Thank you for getting up and yes. coming out. I try to be impossibly fresh. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to now. Thank you. Yeah, you love our new set. Ah, it's fabulous. Yeah, in the new TTT. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> so, Stacy, you know, um, I have seen you deliver motivational um, talks to all um, walks of life. But today we're talking to the youth. Yes. We're talking to the young people. Yes. And help us with four tips for young people in terms of how do we help them to dream and stay inspired? Um, it's, it, could be a, 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 it could be very tricky, especially as teenagers, mm -hmm. to keep um, young people motivated. One of the things you have to, we have to grasp it from the beginning is that in order to inspire someone, you have to reach them. Mm -hmm. They have to be open. The communication has to be constant. Um, of course, because they're teens, it has to be age appropriate and right. excitable. Right. Um, so the four things that I, 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 I like to, to share with, with any adult who is mentoring or, or, or parenting a child. Mm -hmm. um, my first thing is that you want to celebrate what's unique about the child. Yes. Um, and as a parent, sometimes what's unique about your child might be annoying <laughs> to you. Or it might be, it might scare you. Yes. Um, but it's important not just for them to hear you saying it to them, but also for them to hear you celebrating them to others. Like what, for it example? It could be that your child is not as academic but more creative. Right. They might be less academic than their siblings or the children in their class. Yeah. But it is important as a parent for you to, 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 to buy into that and for them to see that you know you, you don't have don't approach it with an angst, that mm -hmm. traditional parenting mm -hmm. angst. You find things that, that will interest them, make it a feel good exchange yeah. between you but and the child. Do you find now that um, the creative industry is uh, booming? It the is. Parents are still not necessarily accepting of of the industry? Exactly. But most parents you, they do not want to hear that their child wants to be an actor or, <laughs> or a seamstress or, you yeah. know, um, so, so which is why it is such a benefit. If yeah. as a parent you say, you know what, this is what my child likes, or oh, this is what you like, because yeah. a lot of teens have no idea what they want to do. Mm -hmm. So when your child has found their niche at an early age, it is wonderful to say yes. Yeah. And, you know, you know, you do, I do, my, my daughter is very creative, so I send her stuff and the same thing she'll do with her friends. If yes. I find something that I think she would like, I would send it to her on social media. We have that exchange. Yes. And sometimes they are very amazed that you like what they like. Mm -hmm. So it, that's quite important. And I'm finding now there's a narrowing of the gap huh? yes, with technology. Yes. Parents, they call their parents perennials, right? <laughs> you have the millennials and the perennials. <laughs> and the parents are able to, to relate yes. to the music, to the fashion, to the conversation. That's also very you important. You also have parents who go out with their, friend, with their with children their and their, their friends. friends. Yeah. And mm -hmm. that's, that brings me to another point. Um, Sometimes we take too much of a serious approach towards in, insp inspiration and motivation for our children. Mm -hmm. It's wise that we know what inspires them. Yeah. Again, sticking with the age appropriate. Um, so that they may be shocked that you might be interested in what they're interested in. Dance all music. And the truth <laughs> is that a lot of these pop um, culture icons yes. do have a success story. Right. So like for a child who may not be excited about what school they would have passed for, it may mm -hmm. not be their first choice. You know, one of the things we share with our, with our teens is that while everybody from everywhere may not end great, anybody from anywhere can. Say that again. <laughs> <laughs> everybody from everywhere may not end great, yes. but anybody from anywhere can. Lovely. And it is important to use these examples. They alre you already start from a good place because they look up to them. Mm -hmm. And learn their success story and bring it Don't to them. Don't just see the end. Exactly. Yeah, because most you of know, the time they see the glamour this, and the glory. Yeah. You do know that she had 25 auditions before a record label signed her up. Right. And, and Is that what you do when you go out to the schools? Yes, yeah. that's a lot okay. of what we do. Yeah. Um, and I, I have to say that it's easier as a mentor than a parent. <laughs> because as a, as you a need parent. to walk the talk. <laughs> tell me you don't. You. I tell you, as a parent, I guess, you know, the, 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 the byproduct of the angst. Yeah. Um, but it helps. The fact yeah. that I practice it outside really helps me. But it's, oh, it's a great approach to inspiring your children. We want to tell them who Steve Jobs is and who's it. But we have to, to think of what moves them, what mm -hmm. gives them that feel good. Mm -hmm. And the third one? The third, the point. third one is, I like to, um, I mean, the more exposure our children have to motivation and, and inspirational people, activity, yeah. and platforms, right. the better. Mm -hmm. um, sticking within the age appropriate, things that, that excite them. Because, you know, sometimes you keep telling your child something and you just, they're glazing over the eyes. They're not getting it. I know that glaze. And then, I know that glaze. <laughs> you know, and, he, and it's the glaze that comes with a smile. Yes. <laughs> and, you know, they're, they're, <laughs> hello. You think they're smiling, but they're glazing past what you're saying. And then they come home and say, you know, Miss Lisa was in school today and she was telling us and they were all excited. Yeah. And it's not, it, for, as a parent, it's not the time for an I told you so. Yes. Just be happy that the seed has just 
germinated mm -hmm. and uh, that somebody was able to send it home. You know, so it is wise for us to be able to surround them with people who will reverberate our good yes. values and if also want experiences instill. as well. So you exactly. speak about people, but even if the opportunity to travel, if not abroad, yes. around, around the huge. country. And, yes? Uh, yes, I'm big yeah. on that. You mm -hmm. know, it's very, it's very smart. Mm -hmm. And um, of course, I also want to talk about the fact that sometimes we need to separate our, 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 t our children from the things that they do wrong. You know, as Trinidadians, we like to own our faults. Oh, right. my head bigger. Oh, gosh, I'm clumsy. Yeah. Right. So we do the same thing with parents. And then no parent of a teenager could tell me that sometimes you fly off the handle and you may call your children names. Right. And, you know, and sometimes it's even good therapy as a parent to be able to say that, you know, mm -hmm. and I want to do better at it. So I, I advise them to separate them from that thing they've done so wrong. So parenting takes a little bit of acting. Mm -hmm. So when my children do something, I would tell them, I am so disappointed and it's not a chance for me to big up my parents and I said I didn't raise you like that I said I don't expect that from you right you know this does not so when I heard mm -hmm. that it just what about having a conversation like, oh, talking must, through talking you it must through talk, yeah? you must talk to yeah you. and again it, if you it, and none of these tips will help yes. if you don't have first have that bond and invest that time mm -hmm. into your child they say thank you so much Such a pleasure you know you're gonna be back here. yes I you know. definitely <laughs> because there's lots inside of lots, this lady you know lots. to stand you're probably wondering how come Lisa's sitting this morning I'll tell you why because if I were to stand up <laughs> right come, 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 come stand up stand up are we gonna do this Lisa this morning I'm out to you I'm out to you thank you so much Stacy but I'm gonna cross right now to Rishi who has something to tell us about the Trinbago Night Riders.